Hey guys, my name is Clive and welcome to another Filmora tutorial videos. So today I'm going to teach you how to apply the AI portrait effect by Filmora to your videos. Now I am a portrait photographer and a videographer and I've recently used this project to one of my portrait videos which I published on my YouTube account. I would really love it and appreciate it if you check out the videos that I make on my YouTube channel. And also I would really appreciate it as well if you subscribe to my channel and you give this video a like. Now every time I see this AI portrait effect by Filmora there's so many wonderful words that comes into my mind. There's fun, there's games, there's neon, there's green, red, um, there's party, there's rollerblades and 80s and 90s and there's so many concepts that you can apply and be creative on how to use this effect to your videos. Now let's head over to Filmora 10 so I can show you how to apply this effect to your video. Alright guys welcome to Filmora. So the first thing you need to do is drag your videos to your timeline and then you need to go to effects and in effects you could see AI portrait. Now in AI portrait you could see a lot of features in there. You have the human segmentation, you also have the human pixelate, human noise, human glitch, human border, and so on. Now there's so many effects that you can choose from, you just need to pick which one that you'd like, and you could also experiment it also in your videos. Um, there's no really um, formula as to how you do it, but just feel free to experiment with it and um, be creative in how you're going to use this effect. Now applying this effect to your video is very easy. The first thing you need to do is basically you just need to drag the effect, the chosen effect that you, you want to the top of your video. And that's just basically it. And you just need to drag it along to the entire length of the video which you wanted the effect to be in. And you could also adjust the border of the effect by double clicking the effect and then go to edge thickness and then you just basically adjust it. And if you feel like you wanted it rapidly tight around your subject, then you just adjust just it on this section. Now what I normally do as well is I mix and match the effects um, to make it look more interesting. So sometimes I layer it with another effect um, and make it more um, fun and make it more dynamic. So what I normally do is I just basically put another effect on top of another effect. Um, let's say for example human border, put it on top of human segmentation and you could also put on top the human glitch and that would combine all the effects that you have for the AI portrait. And once you're done, that's how simple and that's how easy you're going to apply this effect to your videos. All right guys, I'm very interested and very curious as to how you apply this effect to your videos. If you want me to watch your videos, which I'm very, very interested as to how you creatively do magics on this effect. If you want me to watch your videos, don't forget to link your video to the comment section and I'm very, very happy to watch your videos and make some comments. There you have it guys. I hope you find this video very helpful and I shall see you on the next tutorial. Bye.